Bill Riley, Brian Campbell with you here tonight. One nothing win for Real Salt Lake. And a good one tonight for Real Salt Lake. Maybe the biggest win of the year when you consider how tight things have gotten. Letting a couple get away maybe at home that you felt like you could get. And obviously winning the Rocky Mountain Cup and coming on the road to get a victory. It's a big win here tonight for RSL. Well, especially overcoming the, overcoming the odds of being a man down. And the way that this team battled, the way they came together, the way they pressured the ball. And then obviously bonding together to get Nick Romando that that record tying shutout I'd have to agree with you the energy that you're able to generate from this win hopefully carries you through August and through September into October into playoff time nobody happier than our next guest the head coach of Rayel Salt Lake he had hugs around downstairs maybe we'll get a hug later when we see him back oh, at yeah. the hotel <laughs> Jeff Tassar with us right now Jeff smiling <laughs> ear to ear what do you think Jeff you've had some good ones this year was this as big as you've had so far it was huge, you know, because it, it was an unbelievable team effort tonight. Um, you know, the collective effort from each individual. Um, but I was really proud of the way that we stayed disciplined and compact and hard to break down. It kind of looked like uh, how how uh, teams have played against us when we're just 11 v 11 where it's hard it's extremely hard to break down teams uh when you put two banks of four at the top of the 18 and and it's hard to penetrate uh colorado threw everything at us tonight uh and the guys all stood strong so jeff in first half you come out strong about 30th minute you guys lost possession a little bit yep. go, going into halftime what was your message at halftime and obviously the red card came after your your halftime speech but could you take us what you said at halftime and maybe your message to the guys once you got the red card yeah, you know, it, it was, uh, I felt there was a period of time, like you said, Brian, uh, when we were compact, it was hard to play through us, uh, but we were still giving them time, even though we were compact. So I just asked the guys to, even though we're staying nice and compact, that doesn't mean you can relax uh, defensively. Uh, you need to get tight, not let them uh, allow service. Um, and then once we do win it, we have to connect three passes. If we connected three, we are getting eight. If we lost the ball early, it was going to be a long night for us. Hey, Jeff, I thought your subs all played well for you, but I thought in particular Carlos Salcedo, combining with the effort that Nat Borchers was yeah. giving you all night long, I thought your center backs were terrific tonight. Uh, they were unbelievable. You know, and Aaron was Aaron was doing a good job uh, till he got his red card. Uh, but for Carlos to come into that type of game in that situation and have that performance uh, is, is fantastic. Um, you know, Nat was unbelievable tonight. Everybody, what, the effort was unbelievable. Um, I, I told the reporters that I think it it was because Nat's beard, you know, everybody here in Colorado has a beard, and uh, <laughs> Nat felt at home. <laughs> hey, being a former goalkeeper yourself and, and playing with Nick Romando down in Miami, how special is it for, for Nick to get this shutout here in Colorado, being a man down? You know, it's it's just an amazing uh, achievement uh, that he that he's uh, reached tonight. Um, you know, we've we wanted to do it a few games earlier, uh, uh, but to do it down, like you said, down to ten men, where it was a collective effort, where everybody dug in, and and it looked like everybody dug in to to help Nicky get that. You know, now it's now he's got that, now he's got it, and we can move on. Um, but what a uh, und amazing achievement by Nicky. Enjoy the win tonight, Jeff, and then a big one next Saturday against uh, D.C. United, who's playing very well this year, too. Thanks for Thanks, your time. Guys. RSL hosts D.C. United on Saturday, August the 9th. Get your tickets today.